So he's going back on a first attendant. Can you say, give me that one time? Let's go. Yo, what's going on guys? Sit back on that Mutt 15 coin game grind and today we are going to be doing a part three out of a four part series against Rage Like a Boss. We are doing another 50k coin game. Um, got into this game, beat him twice and 2-0 oh against him right now. He wouldn't, say, he wouldn't take no for an answer. He wanted another game. He wanted to try and take, and take a win of take a win from us, then take another win from us, and then take another win from us. <laughs> he, he just wouldn't take no for an answer. He wants another game, you know what? I'm gonna give him another game, and if he beats me, I'm gonna give him another game because he's a good opponent, and I respect the integrity and uh, you know the game that he brings into the game, uh, and the skill level too, so you, you know, you love playing people that are good at the game. So anyway, this is part three of the uh, four part series because there's one more uh, game that we have and then it's kaputs it's capito next year we will <laughs> we will play again and you will notice uh, this game I'm actually going to be running a different defensive scheme and I'm trying to vary it up on offense as you guys can see the first play is going to be a bomb give me that pitch Johnson let's go <laughs> oh my god first play of the game just lobbed it lobbed it because I'm used to his defense. He was running 3-4 bear, uh, cover to invert. He was using the safety. And, uh, you know, we played each other twice already. So we know what we run, so it's easy to stop. So, but, dumbass me, I was like, eh, I'm 2-0 against the kid. Let me try a different defense. So what I tried this uh, game was 3-4 defense. Not the Baltimore Ravens. I was in Philadelphia Eagles because they have the 1-5-5. So I was trying to be cheesy in this game. I was trying to do a 1-5-5 shake, just send in like three and four people, get some block sheds, you know, get some pressure. And if he started running the ball like he is right now, i just send five or six, and then hopefully I can contain it with the shake. The problem with the shake, though, is not even this year, but every year, is it's random. Uh, pressure comes in randomly. It stops the run randomly. You never know when you're going to stop the run, when you're going to get that heat whenever you know you're gonna get a stop or a bad down ball you just don't know and that's my fault for determining that but I played previous games with this defense I was getting actually pretty comfortable running this 155 defense but you know what I guess I was running it against a bunch of bums because I was destroying it and right there as you can see I was just sending four got like immediate pressure and that's what 155 does but against the run it's really not that good because it's random like I said and you're shaking and if you're only sending four against the run and, you know, Rage has a really good run game, it's not really going to work out. And right here, as you guys can see, I'm trying to go up to a face catch. Could not get inside position. And he ends up getting the interception on me. I do not believe that's golden ticket Calvin Johnson. I think I sold him. I'm pretty sure I sold him at this time. Uh, and right there, we get the fumble, but we do not get the recovery. Uh, story of my life right now uh, with this guy. I make him fumble and I cannot really get the recovery. I don't think I've recovered one fumble against this kid. Uh, but anyway, he's just driving 7-7. Seven, seven. He got the interception. He's just driving down. Uh, just running his, his, running his defense, just dinking it up the field. And that's actually a, a pretty good way to stop this 1-5-5. It's just to start dinking your way up the field because the uh, defenders like to back off the coverage when you shake unless you're sending a bunch of people. And then right here, he just goes with his uh, rock set catch glitch animation, which everyone knows by now. It's at the end of the men, and a lot of people know how to do that. Ends up getting the touchdown. So anyway, uh, goes 14-7. We're looking, we're looking, we're looking. We're finding Calvin Johnson, but... Uh, but, there's always a but, we fumble the rock, oh, it was such a good find, and then he just lays the boomstick on us, and then, you know, uh, there was like four red jerseys around there, there's no way we were recovering that ball, and then the next play, he just scores a touchdown, and we are in trouble, we're down 20, we're down 14, Jesus Christ, I like it, this game does not really go our way, <laughs> tried throwing a smoke screen at him, we end up getting to like the one yard line, uh, there's only like one minute left in the first half. We try running the ball. He gets a block shed, ends up smacking us. And on a fourth and three, we use the hurry up. Uh, he read it really well. We tried lobbing it right over his head. Ah, ah, damn it. <laughs> 
couldn't we couldn't lob it over his head and he's really just running away with his game. He's just running the ball, taking up some clock. Um, there's really nothing I could do. This 155 is really not uh, bucking down. But can you say, give me that one time? Let's go! We end up baiting him into a uh, pass with Calvin Johnson. And to be honest with you, I thought I was gone. I thought this was pick six. I thought it was, a, oh, we put in the moves. Yo, Calvin, with that stutter stepped up. I thought we were going to get something. But it doesn't, uh, it doesn't really matter because there's 22 seconds left. And all we're doing is we're just throwing up lob streaks because this game is so horrible. I mean, look at this. You know what's going to end up happening? <laughs> That's exactly what's going to end up happening. This game is so bad. This is why I just cannot stand this game. I'm not even happy about that touchdown because I know how broken this game really is. You can just throw up, you know, bolt streaks, slob streaks, just get inside position. There's nothing your cornerback's really going to do against, you know, like a 6'5 receiver like Calvin Johnson. And just like this, we're back in the game. We're only down to score now. We're, we, it was actually looking really bad. We're just laying boom shots after boom shots right now on this Bo Jackson. He's just not fumbling the ball. And when he does fumble, you know, he ends up picking it up. We're trying to get some um, some good defense going on. He's throwing to that streak again. Or that's actually a fade route. I know that's a fade route. Uh, it's just not working. He's just... He's just getting like four or five yards a clip every run. But now we start sending like six now. We're like, fuck this game. This game is going to be over soon if we don't just start sending six win on like first down when we think he's going to run. Right there, he just dots me up. Another thing that he just keeps doing that just keeps pissing me off is he's just hurrying up to the line. He's just flipping the play and then coming out with it and then reflipping it. Just, um, he just gets to the line like super quick, makes one adjustment. And then he just hikes the ball and he keeps catching me on my O-line. I freaking hate that about this game. They got to fix that. It's been in the game for like two to three years. You just hurry up to the line really quickly. You just It's not fair for the defense because your defense doesn't have time to line up to the ball. And your adjustments are very... You can only do like two adjustments because they keep hurrying up. Uh, they keep quick hiking. You keep getting on your linemen. And when you get on your lineman against like a good player, you're fucking screwed, man. It's just almost like making regular reads. You don't have to worry about someone lurking the field because he's on the line try trying to get a block shit or something like that. But anyway, as I digress, um, third and three, we hit Muhammad Sanu. That was supposed to be Calvin Johnson. But look at this fucking juke. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. You know what? I totally forgot to do something. I, I'm going to pause this commentary right now. I'm pausing the commentary, and I'm redoing that, because that was the filthiest juke I've ever seen in my life by Calvin Johnson. <laughs> Can you say ankles, son? Ankles. <laughs> oh, my God. But you know what? I guess after you do a really great, uh, you know, great play, you just get dumped on with a, a strong power. And that's what I'm talking about with this um, 155. It's just so random. You don't know. And I was stopping the run so well, and then he just... Uh, I just deflated me. I was in this game. The game, I was. it was like a three-point game. It was a three-point game, and then he ran the strong power, got like a 60-yard touchdown, and then I throw this dumb interception. But actually, it wasn't dumb. He baited the shit out of me. He went down like he was playing the flats, and he just went shooting right back up when I was about to throw the ball. It was actually a good user play. <clears throat> and I end up throwing an interception. <clears throat> Not looking good. Down 10. I'm starting to use up my timeouts. It, He's just running strong power. I'm just sending it. And right there, again, man, I was actually not in 155. I remember that play specifically. It was like third and 16. But this is how awful, awful, this is how broken again this game freaking is, man. Third and 16. I'm thinking he's running, uh, passing the ball. I'm in 3-3-5. Three, 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 he runs freaking uh, pistol bunch tight end counter and gets fucking like 25, 30 yards. Like, god damn it. Like, are you kidding me? Like, third and 16. Who runs the ball on third and 16? Apparently this guy does, and he gets a first down. Oh my god, this game is just a freaking headache. This is why I'm not streaming that much anymore. I'm not streaming this much anymore. Making the all rookie squad. I'm really just not having a good time playing this game because it's just it's just so awful, so awful. I might just entitle this goddamn game like a stiff brand because it, this game is just so bad. But anyway, as I digress again. Ends up kicking the field goal. We go down third and 14. He ends up sacking us. Hey, thanks for the follow, Tick Legends. <laughs> Just chop that out real quick. Um, fourth and 24. Ends up picking us off. And I'm like, fuck this game. God damn. I, uh, I, you know what? I'm always like, you know, he unplugged his Xbox. He threw his Xbox out the window. That's exactly what I did. And you know what? I actually had the decency to pause the game and then quit the game and then throw my Xbox out the window. This game is just so garbage. We end up taking a loss, 2-1 in the series, 
Make sure you guys like, comment, subscribe for part four, which will be dropping sometime like next week because PD's starting to, PD's gonna do it again tomorrow. He's starting up on Monday for his road to play me in the Super Bowl. Till next time, guys. Adio.